primary thing that people don't know about Hudson is the fact that it reaches all the way to Highway 20. I like it primarily because it's within eight to 10 minutes of anywhere in Waterloo or Cedar Falls that you might want to go to shop or eat. I think one of the things I'm most proud of as being superintendent here at Hudson is, is our kids. Uh, we have just a really great small family atmosphere. Both of my boys graduated from Hudson. We left for a couple of years outside of the area, but they just could not wait to get back to this small town environment. Uh, the public works in that, in that town are phenomenal. I can go back to the last snowstorm we had. Our streets were all clean before seven o'clock in the entire town. Unbelievable. We have a tremendous fire and uh, EMT unit. It's all volunteer. We usually have about 45 volunteers on staff at all times. One of the things that comes up most often is, uh, is the fact that people want to move to our community and attend our great schools, but they just can't find a place to live. When I became superintendent here eight years ago, we did not have a place to live. And we searched for about six months and ultimately we had to buy a house outside of town and we didn't like that because we both my wife and I grew up in small town Iowa we really wanted to live where I worked and it took a long time before that opportunity came up for echo development group partnering with the city of Hudson was truly a great opportunity we chose to provide time and energy into the development of Hudson uh, based on the current marketplace of new construction in Hudson. With so many people looking to move to Hudson with limited opportunities, Twin Oaks seemed to be the right time and right place to provide an opportunity for folks to, that either wanted to stay in Hudson or were looking to move to Hudson. In a community where you can truly have it all, it seems to be a perfect fit. Hudson, where you can have it all. Hudson, where you can have it all. Hudson, where you can have it all. Hudson,